Hi everyone, Charlotte here from the Active Campaign Education team. Welcome to today's Building Basics video where we go through the basics of the platform to help you get familiar and comfortable in navigating it. This video will cover setting up site tracking, but before we start, if you find this video helpful, don't forget to hit that like button, also subscribe to our channel and make sure to turn the notifications on so that you can get an alert every time we post a new video. We're also happy to read any questions or thoughts that you may have in the comments section below. Now, site tracking shows you which pages on your website were visited by known contacts. For example, let's say that I have a pet shop, right? With active campaign site tracking, I will be able to see that Emily went to our products page and was looking at one of our leashes. Knowing this information will allow you to automatically create personalized experiences for each of your contacts as they interact with your website. You might be wondering how contacts are identified. Well, there are two ways to identify contacts who visit your page. The first one is when contacts click on a link in a campaign sent from Active Campaign, and the second one is when they submit a form created in Active Campaign. Site tracking is quick and easy to set up. We recommend that everyone set up site tracking because it's a core feature that enables more powerful marketing and sales processes. Let's jump onto the platform and configure it together. To access site tracking, we click on settings, then we click on tracking, and in this page, there's three things that we need to do. The first one would be to click the enable toggle to set it to the on position. Then we need to add the websites, pages or subdomains that will use site tracking in the whitelist and installed cost section. The include all website pages will be selected by default. And this means that each page on your domain will be whitelisted. And finally, we need to copy and paste the site tracking code into the footer of each page on your website that you want to track, so that this way Active Campaign can communicate with your website. And that's it. That's site tracking set up for us. Thank you for watching up until here. Don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel, hit that notification button to get alerted on new videos about the new features and functionalities that you can be utilizing in your very own active campaign account. See you soon.